as we start to learn how to approach rolling objects in a physics or an AP physics class, there are a couple things to note, a couple really important ideas that are easy to make mistakes with. First, not all forces are going to apply at the center mass of the object. Now, because we've got to consider torque, we need to worry about where forces are applied on a rotating object, because this force right here this is going to be our static friction force right here. It's going to work in the direction opposite that of motion or possible motion always. And notice that that is going to be applying a torque. If I were to draw a dotted line in between them and label this as R, we could write the torque equation as R crossed with F. What this means is torque is a vector is the cross product of the distance in between the axis of rotation and where the force is applied so it matters where the force is applied we also can draw in the normal force here on the edge of the rigid object but that of course applies no torque 